Hi, I would like to share with you a bit of scripture from the book of uh, 2 Timothy. Um, <clears throat> it's from chapter 3, uh, starting with verse 1. This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come, for men shall be lovers of their own selves, covetous, boasters, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, unthankful, unholy, without natural affection, truce breakers, um, false accusers, incontinent, fierce, despisers of those that are good, traitors, heady, high-minded, lovers, lovers of pleasures, more than lovers of God, having a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof, from such turn away. <clears throat> For of this sort are they which creep into houses and lead captive silly women laden with sins, led away with diverse lusts, um, ever learning and never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. Now as Janus and Jambres withstood Moses, so do these also resist the truth. Men of corrupt minds reprobate concerning the faith, but they shall proceed no further, further folly shall be manifest unto all men, as theirs also was. Now, now, that's P Paul talking about um, the times to come, which I believe is talk talking about today. Um, he says that, um, that, that says in these verses that um, that um, men shall be lovers of their own selves. I mean, they should be covetous, boasters. They should be proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, and thankful and holy. And, they, they should be without any natural affection. They should be truth breakers, um, false accusers, and content that's without self control, um, fierce despisers of those that are good, traitors, heady, high minded, lovers of pleasures more than lovers of God, having a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof. And, and, um, <clears throat> And and these are talk these are talking about pe the people um, and and this I mean th this is this day and age um, they're um, ba basically um, all all these and and more and um, and P Paul says from such we should turn away from these people I mean. Are, are, is this necessarily talking about unbelievers? No, I mean, we're, I mean, I mean, he's saying, saying they have, they're, they're having full form of godliness, but they're denying the power thereof, and um, that, that is talking about so-called Christians and. Um, The, these people um, are religious people, but they don't have the um, power to, within that ch that changes lives. And um, these these people are um, basically um, false converts to uh, Christianity, and um, they um, need to be turned away from, and um, they're just. Um, and it says, um, these are these are the they that creep into houses. They lead captive silly women that are laden with sins, led away with diverse lusts, ever learning and never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. And um, now, now the scriptures also mention um, Janus and Jambres, um, which I believe are um, the. Um, Two Egyptian magicians who um, who withstood um, Moses and um, I mean the I mean so do these also resist the truth men of corrupt minds reprobate concerning the faith I mean these are um, people who are, people who are reprobated those are um, 
consider, considered reject, rejected and um, very, very sinful and um, basically worthless um, concerning the uh, faith. Yeah. Anyway, really isn't much I can um, d describe to these people and just um, this scripture set speaks pretty much for for themselves. I mean, anyway, that's all I really have to share with you today. So, have a good day, and God bless you.